Uh, talk about some of the emotions when you first stepped on the uh, pitch at, here at Yankee Stadium. Uh, it was a great feeling to see so many fans here today and it was my first professional debut and I'm really happy to be part of this team and I don't know, hopefully many more games for me to come. What were you able to, you know, you had brought aggressiveness, you brought some great defense, what were you able to do so well? Oh, uh, I don't know, I'm... I think I can apport to the team attack, my attacking the spread because I'm obviously going I'm better going forward than defensive but I obviously need to pro improve here with this place so I can improve my defensive spread as well so really happy to be here. Uh, the team you know started off to an early lead and then Toronto FC came back. Well you standing on the sidelines were you able to see anything that you know you capitalized on or? No I don't know it's my first game with this club and I think we did great to come back, and hopefully the next few games we can we can stop conceding goals, but step by step. Cuando ganábamos 2-0, Jovinko había fallado penalti. Parecía como que era ese típico partido que todo sale bien, que íbamos a golear. De repente nosotros solo nos complicamos, nos hacen o ayudamos a que nos hagan tres goles en, en seis minutos y un partido que iba a ser para victoria sobrada de repente en seis minutos pasamos a perder. Well, uh, at the beginning it was just how can I put it? It was a very strange game. At the beginning we were winning 2-0 and Jovinko had um, took but the penalty and it looked like the typical a game that is going to be easy and everything okay and we're going to have like a huge advantage and then we ourselves made mistakes for ourselves and then we had we suffered three goals against in like six minutes and then what looked like an easy victory became a very complicated match for us. And I would like to add that we have the best goalkeeper in the whole league, so I mean, if it wasn't for him, it would be a bigger problem. What about his emotions when he first made his debut for New York City FC today? Probablemente le han hecho esta pregunta antes, pero quisiera que comente sobre sus emociones de haber debutado hoy día con la camiseta de New York City Football Club. Hombre, la verdad es que ha sido precioso, ¿no? Eh, todo desde el comienzo del partido, pues bueno, encontrarme en un estadio pues mítico como este, la gente pues me ha recibido fenomenal. Y, y me da pena ¿no? no haber podido ayudar más y, y poder haber ganado el partido de hoy, la verdad. Well, the, to tell you the truth, it was very beautiful from the beginning. I mean, to start uh, in such a mythical stadium and people really received me very warmly it was wonderful. I'm just sad that I couldn't help more and that couldn't, we couldn't come out with a victory. It was such a back and forth type of match. Uh, talk about the emotions of the, everything and you know being able to come out with an eventual draw. Y entonces fue un partido tan de ida y vuelta y de cambios. Podrías hablar sobre las emociones de todo el proceso y haber finalmente logrado conseguir por lo menos un empate. Sí, yo creo que sobre todo en el momento que nos hemos puesto 2-0 arriba, ya teníamos que haber pues bueno parado un poco más el partido, eh, bajarle un poco el, el ritmo, que no fuera tan de ida y vuelta y bueno no lo hemos conseguido eh, y, y bueno pues han, hemos tenido ahí unos minutos muy malos en el que nos han dado la vuelta al marcador y, y ha sido la clave porque bueno luego ya en la segunda parte yo creo que el equipo ha estado bastante mejor well yes I mean really at the point when it was 2-0 we should have tried to you know slow down the match a little bit and have a little bit more control and not let the match be such a back and forth offensively and we didn't manage to do that and really then we had a, a stretch of very bad minutes where they turned things against us and we were down and then I think after that we stabilized and in the second half we actually played a good match uh, what's the biggest lesson that you could take from today's match and your first experience in Major League Soccer? ¿Y cuál es la mayor lección que saca usted del partido de hoy de su primera experiencia con la MLS? Muchas cosas, ¿no? Yo creo que me tengo que, que adaptar eh, rápido. Eh, todavía llevo muchos pocos entrenamientos con, con mis compañeros. Eh, estoy seguro que puedo mejorar. Y, y bueno, eh, 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 no estoy contento del todo, ¿no? Con, con mi actuación. Yo creo que, que puedo dar mucho más y estoy seguro que los siguientes partidos van a ser mucho mejores. Well, a lot. I mean, I have to learn a lot. I have to try to adapt quickly. I haven't really trained with my uh, teammates much, and I'm sure I'm going to improve. 
uh, I'm not totally happy with my performance. I know that I can play better, and I'm sure that the next few matches I'm going to improve. How about the way the team is going right now? Yeah, definitely. I think um, we're very excited on the results we've been getting and uh, some of the performances, and obviously, you know, I hope uh, the guys coming in are as excited as we are going forward to try and keep stringing together good results.